Okay, it's running. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. <laughs> Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. What's that? What do you find? Camera. A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. Not always. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. What's a weird? Your guns, we got Dan. guns, bro. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are. But they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. Bro, you think I won't kill you? Fuck I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. Something I'm fucking same to you. Screw this. Y'all wave them guns like you're looking to die. Don't need to go looking for death. It's already found us. Dead. Shit. What the hell'd you do that for? We had she a had deal a with phone. them. She was about to shoot us both. You could have just taken her down. You didn't have to kill her. I killed her because she had a bow. I mean, hanging. I know she was crazy, but damn. I will kill her. <sighs> I'll kill anyone who holds a weapon on me. It's, it's a clean shot, movie. though. Right through the forehead. Yeah, That's dang. good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Yeah, that's the point. That's why I shot it. You wanna shoot us? We'll shoot you. I got a revenge for them. You wanna shoot my friends? We'll shoot you. Nice boat. Come on. Make the arrows. I don't care, man. Just keep walking. Did it. She held a weapon. She had a bolt. We had guns. At that point, I was just taking out. I was cleaning the gene pool, you know? I'll kill you guys. How? Still miss. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? <coughs> what? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. You're back. What happened? Lee yeah, took care of it. Bitch. 
my dad, I took care of it. I don't know who these people are, maybe they're dirty. This but I isn't what to Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Such a bitch. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. Sweet and ass. thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. <laughs> What's she doing? Finally! <laughs> I'm gonna keep you aware of putting you. <laughs> oh no, this is a different next thing. It's my head. Yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding. Toolbox. Use a toolbox. No, we don't need to. We'll just talk to the people see how you run us. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy with a crossbow pointed right at my head. So I had to kill her. Jesus Christ! Did you at least get some goddamn food? No, nothing. I knew it. It was a mistake coming here. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over oh. and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. That's certain. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. He survived. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Yeah. Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. You guys don't need and I love him. He doesn't need to get ticky the whole time, man. Did you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Yeah, don't worry about it. The woman just a bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. I've still got my fire axe, name. 
can bust some hits. So those guys get angry, I shut them, I'm just gonna be straight up. I will shoot anyone who shoots my friends and, and uh, anyone who aims a weapon at me. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> like did that. you lick it? <laughs> yeah. She did I lick don't it. know. I don't know. She definitely licked it. How do you not know if you lick something? Last time I checked, I never forgot about licking something that tastes something. Yes, good. Well, I'll talk to some people, see how they are. How are you, Andy? Hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Okay, I'm not going to have this yep. from really. Got a really key out. I'm not actually hungry. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. <laughs> Have I missed anything? No, not really. Mm, what if it smells funny in here? What if he knows? Like duty. Duty. <laughs> Kids. Don't talk about duty, naughty, naughty. <laughs> Can't even talk to her. Oh, I should give her a hat back. Here, Clementine. I only shot that woman, to be honest, because she took Clem's hat. Like, bit. My hat! Taking you found hat. it! Bang! That's what's gonna happen. I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motorhead who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's...